All right, so first off, how we doing, fam? Kind of a brand new day of recording. Shout out to all of you who've been kind of supporting each video. It means a lot to me, all the likes and everything. Since the views aren't always updated, it's just kind of nice. It's like people get to my content before I can like pen my own comment, you know, which is kind of crazy considering I'm the one that's like selecting when it goes live. But anyways, love you all. Let's go ahead and get this. All right, and we're back. Hey, appreciate love us, part. Like I said, the intro means a lot to me. Let's go ahead and uh, keep this show rolling. I can't wait to head up to the eye again. The back pedal, though. <laughs> I love that so much. New Atlantis. So as I'm putting up this video, the reviews are finally out. We got a lot of like nines, some tens. A few sites gave it like sevens and eights. I feel like it's a good mix. I feel like the game is on pretty much on par with like the Fallout and Skyrim stuff, but also at the same time, it just feels like a fresh experience, you know? I'm gonna run in here or wherever. Is this a store? What is this? There's like nobody working. <laughs> Never mind. Let's go to our ship. You know what? I just realized I don't even have to do that. Let's just go ahead and go to the star map. All right, so let's go ahead and go back. Back again. It is saying to go here, so what is the actual objective? Go to the eye. Okay. Wait a minute. Was I not already there? I haven't played in like two days. Sorry. There we go. We just had to get into space. It's all good. I've heard the ships later on are insane. They have like max stats on the... Oh wait, hold on. Let me... Speaking of which... Let me put... Three into that. For now. That's fine. Every time we get close to this stuff... Okay, it says hell. Aha! Uh -huh. The eyes always open to Constellation. I have a bad feeling we're getting really close and nothing else is popping up yet. I usually crash into this stuff. Alright, Doc, here we go. I always think about Back to the Future every time I see that. Doc! I know it's not the same thing, but... It's kind of funny. But an excellent game. Uh, also, the first video... And we had like, I feel like we had like a quarter of a million views in like seven hours. It was insane. I've never seen that. Hello, I am Sam. Actually, I've seen it, but not in a while. Survived your most recent sleep cycle. You know what? Before we do anything, uh, do I have to go back this way for the? Actually, I think the ship cargo should be accessible. Uh, yeah, here we go. Cargo hold. Yeah, right now I, can, I got uh, 248 out of 450. I need to put a lot of this stuff up that I have because I just feel like... Let me go to my actual inventory. That stuff I already have in there. I need to go through when I'm not recording and sell a bunch of stuff. But for right now, I just feel like... I don't need to have all these different outfits. You know, <laughs> like... These other ones are clean, though. Okay, here's what I'm wondering. I, you know, I think we wear this because physical is what I'm looking at. This one's a pretty balanced one. They're all about the same, really, now that I think about it. Fifth, so, the other one's 15, 5, 15. These are, you know what? Let's store these. I, I'm happy with what I currently have. That should free up a little bit of space. Helmets. Uh, I thought that said dead space. <laughs> I was like, what? All right, 140 now. Packs, we only need one of those. Throwables. I mean, I'll pretty much get rid of these by hurling them at enemies <laughs> eventually. Uh, resources, here's where it kind of gets a little wild. You don't need all of this. Look how much space it frees up. All right, we're good. We don't have infinite space on the ship, but we, you know, we'll take our time. I don't want to get like overloaded at the beginning of the video. Setting so. up some software. Want to test the computer over there? Help Vladimir code up this system the first time. All right, test connection. Here we go. Test the computer. Check in on everyone. Now, how did this work again? Now that is some fine team. Lend a hand. Grab a couple of wrenches and let's tighten this equipment down. That's, uh, cutting pliers. That's done it. Go on. See who else. 
Let's That's kind of funny. It's just like, I didn't really do anything. I just picked it up and it kind of auto-completed. Hey, you mind helping me weld up some of these panels? Ah, uh, miss coming up. Yeah. You should visit Vlad more often. All right, talk to Vladimir. This is funny, as far as welding goes, I did it for the very first time. My dad's like big on that kind of stuff. And uh, I tried it for the first time with him, like maybe a few months back. It was pretty Never wild. regretted coming out of retirement. Constellations got the writ of the righteous. Keeps me young. You call it the wrong wires. Station showing red. Ah, uh, was there some kind of problem with repairs someone I made? Nastier than I measured. Figured a few of the parts might be iffy, but this is going to take more than a span. I won't leave you hanging, Vladimir. Cora and I can stay with you until the eye is back to 100%. No need for the martyr's clothes, but I'm happy to have the help. As for you, while we're giving the eye the swords, need to tip your ear on another matter when you got the time. Wow. Leveled up already. I wasn't expecting that for a little while. Okay. Wellness. We got pain tolerance. Physical damage reduced by 5%. I don't know. I'm like torn. I feel like I've gone heavily into physical early on. The weightlifting, I can also increase that. I don't think I'll ever put points in here. Energy damage and physical be kind of like the two things. Uh, food and drink are 10 times more. Or no, 10 times 10% more effective. Okay. Let's go to social. I'm just curious. I haven't bought a lot of stuff in this game. And I feel like currency... I've heard later on in the game you get outposts. You get better ships. And they apparently cost a lot. So I've... We're not there yet, obviously. But eventually... I feel like a lot of these just bump everything up 10% then I'm assuming they go, yeah. Weapon range, interesting. So I kind of wonder, I mean, I could do this, but medicine, unlock, uh, see, resources required to craft items reduced by 10%. I just don't know. You know what? I'm gonna go with this. Just because. I kinda wanna well, get you more into things? the space combat. Not bad. Don't want to worry anyone, but we got more competition. Not Starborn. Rival Collector. Captain Petrov owns a salvager vessel called the Scow. Runs it like a palace of novelties. And he's got a new prize in his collection. Guessing you won't hand it over easily, yeah. Pretty much. Reached out through my hand to hands to see if we can do an honest swap. He says the rock ain't for sale for any price. Think we're gonna need a crowbar and bag for this one. Say so we need to steal it from him. Wait a minute, Vladimir, I'm not a thief. He's got a reputation for seeing the gold in things, but he's no lab coat. Thinking he knows it's unique, but not why. All the more reason to clutch tightly. I saw he's the first one, I feel like. Left the life of a jacob once behind myself. I know what I'm asking. But I see a clutch prize not up for the prying any other way. Not sending you lone hook on the job. I want Barrett with you on this one. You two will be foot to foot the whole way. So make sure you're ready. All right. Ready now. Uh, let's see. Let's go do it. Catch a smile out there. Barrett's gonna be locked as our. He's gonna be locked as our companion for a bit. That's fine. All right, here we go. Talk with Barrett. Wasn't he? Hold on. Wasn't he back here? Unless he's teleported already. Oh, wait, there's Barrett. I've been meaning to thank you for helping me with the Crimson Fleet before. I could have handled it myself, of course, but it's good working with a team. Uh, you're welcome. Glad to help out a fellow Constellation member, all right? It's good to be part of a team, isn't it? To be part of something so much bigger than any one of us. So many things can go wrong out there. Working with people you can trust is important. That's why I've been in Constellation so long. It's good to have people who will help out when you're in a jam. 
Introvert. Uh... Uh, just wait till we get matching shirts and start having official cookie days. Charming, but no thanks. I'm guessing gourmet chunks days are out of the question then. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm just joking. Constellation is so much more than that. Speaking of which, your work with Constellation has been impressive. Truly impressive. Uh, thank you, Bert. Just figured I'd mention it, since we haven't had much time to chat before. You know, being a member of Constellation has given me a lot of opportunities, and a fair bit of stress, I'll admit. It's hard to imagine just who I'd be had I never joined up. I would have never done so many things, met so many people. It's mind-boggling how different I would be. And I never would have met Irvin. Or lost him. I suppose. It's impossible to know what could have happened, yeah. That's right. We can't know the consequences of the choices we never made. And anything beyond that is imagination alone. But for the choices we made, it feels just a bit closer, doesn't it? Urban's been gone for over 20 years. Strange how memories can pop up when you least expect it. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to say. Pretty much sums up how I feel. Yeah, don't worry. Logically, I know I should be over it. But I'm not, and it's gotten worse lately. I've ignored my feelings about Irvin's death since it happened. It's time for me to confront it. I'm just fortunate that Constellation has been a supporting home for me since Irvin died. I mean, where else would I get to dodge space pirates and discover new planets? On that note, I think I'd do well to distract myself with a little adventure for a bit. Alright. Nice little uh, catch-up conversation. It seems like towards the end of the last video, he was definitely wanting to chit-chat a lot. So, at least we got that. Alright, Frontier time. Alrighty. What's the plan, Captain? One thing I may check out. Let's check out the research station. I don't want to, like, put away a lot of the items. I'm just curious. I'm gonna start like putting a lot of these where they go. That way I can at least. I mean, I probably should have done this before I put away everything, right? We have enough for this one. Confirm. We don't have enough for the whole. Yeah, the full thing's gotta be. That's completed. 75%. We're missing uh, adaptive frame. We need one of those. Eventually, I wanna get into the outpost up, but I'm pretty sure what I've read. From other people is that you don't see that till later on. So I'm just trying to get to the story best I can right now. Plus the story is actually really intriguing. I don't know what's going on with the artifact. We got our first like power a few videos ago. Not even sure why I sat down. We can just do this. <laughs> back, back, back. Alright, we're going over here. Here we go. Looks like oh over here, okay. Cannot travel while ship is docked. I do I always do the same thing. It's funny. I mean, it makes sense. All right, now I can do it. All that for no reason. I saw somebody say, uh, "Hey, can you not land on this and that?" It's like, it's like the sun. You're not gonna land on it. All right, here we go. Oh, it was so funny. People getting roasted on Twitter like, you can't let that planet. It. It's gas, you know? I just really like the vibe of this game a lot. I think it's also, if you take into account how many times they re-released Skyrim over the years and all this other stuff, I feel like this game will be here for a very long time. It'll have like a nice following. I don't know what's going on with all this debris. Oh, that is debris filled. All right. Uh, persuade. It might be time. No one uninvited was this cow. Captain's orders. Alright, we gotta get to four. We got three turns. We almost have enough for auto persuade, so I'm pretty sure we'll get this. Let's just start with maybe... 
I want to see it for myself. That's a little, like... Ford, I feel like. My captain does love letterers. Uh, auto-persuade? Hey, now. We're not looking for trouble. All right. I'll clear you to dock. Keep yourself out of trouble. Or we'll have every hired gun in the cargo bay after you. All right, here we go. Trying to like dodge some of the uh There we go. But an excellent game. I just feel like you know they're gonna take care of it for a very long time because I feel like the way Bethesda's always been towards a lot of their open world games like this, Skyrim Fallout, they always add to it, they always like update it a lot. This being like Xbox's biggest release in forever. What, since, like, Halo Infinite? I don't know how that launch went. I remember playing it, but, uh... I don't know. I don't know how it's doing now. It was a fun campaign. That's all I remember. Sweet rolls. Dumbbell. Utility knife. It's always like a lot of like random junk. I feel like if you really wanted to make a lot of money in this game, you could probably we'll sell a lot. Board. But Petrov was done hiring mosquitoes. Or maybe you're after something from the captain's collection. Uh, let's see. Special rock. I'm here to party. Mosquito? Let's do that one. Well, he calls us some old earth term. That old fancy earth. All right. Oh, yes. The Rock. He's not selling it. But if you want to hear him laugh in your face personally, go right ahead. Yeah, we'll check with him directly if you don't mind. Go on, then. I couldn't see Bear right there. It's like he was behind something or like the screen was covered up. Trade it for Some dusty hauling ore from the fringe. <laughs> was glad when he left. It's all shakes and muttering. What else uh, hauling besides salvage? Let's Petrov's see. got a whole little alien zoo in the back. He's asking for trouble with those things. But the locks on the cages are pretty high end. Thankfully. Strewn about all over. The good stuff's locked up in a vault for Petrov's own personal viewing pleasure. And before you ask, Petrov's the only one with the keys, so don't try bribing any of the crew. You just waste your money. All right. Why did it seem like we were so much closer? That's funny. Yeah, what is down here? I'm. Ooh, I'm shivering here. What is that? A heat leech. No, oh, thank you. I'm good. Oh my god, I think that might be... Yeah, I'm technically stealing, my bad. Sorry about that. Yeah, I don't want to cause any uproar, so I'm just going to chill out. Somebody asked me how I prepare to do, like, my videos. What I did for the last hour, I danced with my daughter in the living room watching uh, Kung Fu Panda. We watched the third one. We get to the credits and just keep replaying it because of the music. That's what I do! Yo, look at the... It's like... I can't tell if it's scars or if that's like... Huh. It's kind of weird. I'm like right up in their face doing that. The other side of the what? Narian War? I'm not sure what that is. Welcome to Petrov's Palace of Peculiarities, the pinnacle of perfect procurement, the penultimate palace. I didn't mean to come all the way downstairs. This opens up. It's like a conveyor belt. All right, let's uh, let's go back up. We kind of fell down back there, and let's uh, go back to where we were. 
That's cool. Kind of looks like a dinosaur type <laughs> skeleton, I guess. Or skull, whatever. Return of the Interceptor this fall. Yo, I'm just like going through everybody's stuff. Med pack. I really want that, but I'm not about to steal it in front of everybody. Okay. Expert. So wait, where, hold on. Where are we going on the map? Let me, hold on. Let me just... I guess you can't... Oh, that's so cool. Oh my good. Look at that. I get so caught off guard by like how much... Crazy stuff is in this game. Wait, can you go through here? Oh, you can. But this is oh, also a dead end. What I've done. These are just like the rooms, okay. Follow this. Trauma pack. There we go. This is a cool area. Look at all this. Yes? What? That's so sick. Ah! I wasn't aware we had the visitors. What? You didn't tell me we had visitors. We have visitors. Excellent. Now that you've gone to all this trouble to get here, you should make yourself at home. Relax. Kick up your feet on the tables. I don't care. They have scorch marks on them anyway. Uh, attack? That's crazy. I'm gonna do the second one. Oh, ho, ho. flattery, huh? My favorite pastime, huh? Between you and me, I do have something very special in the vault. Ah, but my jealous heart knows no bounds. I want to keep it all to myself. Uh, persuade, attack, bear it. Uh, no, I'm good. Let's do this one. Tempting. I do love showing off. But my security team will have a heart attack. It would be against all those protocols that I admittedly told them to make. All right, let's see. We got, we got to get the six. Oh my goodness! Imagine going straight for it. I feel like this one's kind of going against the grain a little bit, because this personality's like nice and polite right now. Even plus six seems okay. But I feel like it's a little too soon to just go for the home run, you know? This would get it done, though. What's the good of a vast collection if you can't show it off? Oh, -ho, you do have a point. I'm a constellation. I'm not sure which one to do here. Because it's like... If I... Hmm... That's what Vladimir nah, said. I'm not interested. I honestly think if we get one more turn, we can only get it done if we get plus four or plus six. I might go with this one just because it seems... This is what I wanted to go with originally. I just didn't want to go for the home run, but here we go. Oh, perhaps you're right. What good is a collection no one else sees? Huh. Ah, very well. What's a quick look going to hurt, huh? Nice. I know. You know, people look at me and say, Petra, me, your whole ship is a testament of ship splendor. We Why person. do you need a special vault? Well, all I can say is that even the greatest collection needs its own private viewing area. Plus, between you and me, there are thieves everywhere. So I spared no expense. Every door between me and my treasures is painful. But that is the price of security, huh? Que sera? Just a bit further. 
This ship and I have been through some adventures, I'll tell you. I once collected salvage from a demo celestial class while it was exploding. The crew was scraping scorch marks and bits of metal off the hull for weeks. And of course, there was the time I accidentally steered us into a UC Navy vessel under a particularly uproarious celebration of my latest acquisitions of fine art. But we were wedged perfectly between their two thrusters and were able to just kind of push them back into the star yard for repairs. All right, see what we got. See these treasures, you know? I feel like I'm walking way too fast. Like, I, I can't, like, just casually stroll behind him, you know? I gotta, like, run every time. All right, still the artifact. Ugh. And now, the moment itself. The problem is if we just ah, take it. Beautiful, isn't it? The man who sold me this told me that it spoke to him. That holding it for the first time was like drowning in your own soul. Alas, I've held it several times, and my soul is still breathing, devoid of any such enlightenment. I'll pay for it. Name your price. Ah, Let's go with this one first, just kind of like, see what else maybe transpires from it. Why, yes, he did. I don't like this one because it seems like he's a nice guy and I don't want to attack him, so I'm just going to go with this one and see what happens. Oh, no. No, no, no. I can't. This one is mine. And it's only fair to warn you. Hands off. I would hate to sour our new friendship by becoming the victim of piracy. We're not pirates, Petrov. We're explorers who might do a bit of piracy on the side as a hobby sometimes. Grab the artifact. <laughs> Sorry, it's for science. I'm afraid not. I'm easy in all things, except my collection. All right, you know what? Let's try this one. If this doesn't work, we're gonna go for the grab the artifact. Then I suppose it's just a question whether my immeasurable love for my collection and my crew of hired cutthroats is enough to stop you. Go ahead. Make a move for the artifact. Let's see what happens. Uh, would it help if I said we needed it for scientific research? That's a pretty good point. It really is boiling down to me just collecting it. Time to break a sweat for a change. Easy Wait, peasy. I surrender. I surrender. Don't All right, nice. Me. It was supposed to happen. The captain's word is good. Done. Stand down, everyone. Let the nice pirate pass. His health bar got deleted once he started shooting us. I was hitting <laughs> with that legendary pistol. This thing absolutely cooks. So if they're not going to attack me for stealing this, maybe I can steal other stuff. What about this little piggy bank made of gold? No, I don't want to mess with this guy's stuff too much. I just want to just, like, get what's, uh... That is a nice-looking helmet. Whatever. Prototype equipment. What is this? Ooh. Master. Oh, my goodness. Okay. 
damn pirate. Get what you came for and leave. Well, this is about to be... Hopefully nobody does attack. We'll see. Hold on, is there anything else back down here? Like, the icon is way over there. Hold on, let's see. Oh, it's still the same spot. Okay. We gotta walk back. I thought it might be like a shortcut, but it's always to where you gotta go, like, undock and everything. So, kind of have to go back to it. That was cool. Stealing the artifact, uh... A little more intense than I was expecting, having to make a choice like that. Because the guy was so nice, you know? I was like, I don't know, man. But now that icon is gone to where it's like, I don't think it lets us, like, really steal anything. I guess we'll find out. Everybody's just like on high alert still. There we go down. Wait. Yeah, down here. To the right? Yeah, here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna take everything now. Cause like the icon's not actually there anymore, so. Before, if you went to steal something, it would actually like be like, hold on now. That went a lot smoother than I expected. Once he was kind of like not wanting to sell it, I didn't know what to do, you know? This is the beginning. Here we go. All right, back on the frontier. Here we go. Hello, ship. Hmm. This place needs more decorations, don't you think? I can't wait to get a new ship. I'm sure it'll happen probably towards the end of the game. I've read a lot of the stuff that said most of the end game stuff doesn't happen until obviously you finish the story, but like outposts, everything, eventually you will get them. Okay. Star map, let's see. Let's go ahead and go back. Let me just like zoom in so I can actually click on it. There we go. Sometimes it takes a minute. Wait, wait. Went there. And then I clicked there. The lodge, here we go. I feel like at that point you should just have like a button where you could just always, cause we come back here more than anything else in the game. Like I don't know how many times we're actually gonna go to like the neon city, you know, like. Wouldn't have that on a shortcut, but maybe this one, for sure. Or like a favorites button, you know? Alright, here we go! Leveled up! Vladimir! Vlad, come in! Come in! Hold on, hold on. What we do anything? I think we can actually upgrade this once we get... We need three more. Okay. You know what I'm kind of thinking about trying? I'm honestly debating about... The medicine. I mean, that would also be really nice. Tech and security. We just need to get, like, one more of those. I feel like this column's kind of underrated a little bit. At least from my perspective. The medicine thing's fine. Uh, geology. 15%. Interesting. I Here's what I'm wondering. I feel like this... Reduces fuel cost by 50%. Let's get one of these. I feel like later on that may help us. There we go. The eye's gone completely dark. I, I can't reach anyone on the station. Noel, Starborn, came out of nowhere. Vladimir, get out of there! He already left. 
said he was going to, uh, to the lodge. Hold on, Vladimir. We're coming for you. Sam, uh, he's, he's still breathing, but oh God, all that blood. Hello, Constellation. Are you there? Who are you? What did you do to our friends? They call me the Hunter. And now that I'm here, your part in glimpsing the unity is over. So the Hunter, interesting. Stop this, we don't mean you any harm. Oh, if anyone is hurt on the eye, you're dead. I like that one. I'm already on my way. Say goodbye to your friends. It won't be long. Forget about us. That starborn bastard is after the artifacts. You can't let him take them. Pack up the collection, move it somewhere they can't find it. Damn it. Vladimir's right. We need to get the artifacts packed up, and that means holding off the starborn. What about everyone on the eye? We can't leave them to die up there. Uh, let's see, it might be too late. We need to stay here, protect artifacts. I'm gonna go rescue him. Why wouldn't we, right? Look, I get it, but our best chance is staying here. I don't know how long it's gonna take to pack up the artifacts. I... I'll get started. Hopefully this will only take a few minutes, if my hands can stop shaking. Take cover, everyone. Where? Do you really expect them to barge through the front door? That's right, Walter. He's just stopping I'll by for a chat. I'll work as fast as I can. Protocol. Could you all keep it down? I'm trying to work here. That's so cool. Walter! Are you alright? Hold on, let's go check on Walter. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The Hunter, level 30. There's more than one? Like, no damage. I don't think we can. Hold on, let me heal up. That was crazy that the hunter just showed up like that. Okay, I guess I have to like wait for everybody else to go in there first. Get to the ship. Well, let's hit the fan really fast. It's funny, I was just talking about how we always come back to the lodge, you know, and now we're like leaving it. Had I used all my grenades though. That was all I had. <laughs> I'm assuming you can kill the hunter. I do like no damage. Go run, go run. Kind of like leaving everybody else. I mean, like, what about <laughs> everybody, you know? We made it! Kind of. Yeah, we're not out of the woods yet. Hold on. Wow. Okay. 
I don't even know if it's worth fighting. It feels like it's not. Let's just run. One time you can't just fast couple to the ship. Somebody else is taking off. All right, almost there. It doesn't make sense to fight them because they're insanely dangerous. Let's say pop up on the ship behind us. Imagine that. All right, go to the eye. We have to risk it. We be dying there. Nah, uh, let's just take off. Normally, I would like. You know, wait or whatever, but. It's actually pretty intense. Oh, no. Attack, uh, let's see. I was merely taking the shortest path to my destination. But now, I think I'll just kick back and enjoy the long road. Well, let's start recording the first one. There's a greater purpose to all this. You might have a larger role than I realized. A mistake on my part. Keep collecting the artifacts. We'll meet again. Maybe you'll glimpse the unity yet. They just vanish. All right, Scorpius. Going back up, back up, and going to the eye. Hold on. It's actually right in front of me. I just let me hold on, let me just tab out. Yeah, it's right over here. Here we go. I wonder. Hold on. How far away is that? Oh my god. Yeah. Let's uh. <laughs> let's just do that then. Back up some. Go to the eye. Here we go. That's so far away. First, I was just gonna go over there, and I was like, "That didn't work." No, but, nah. Be here a long time. I cannot wait to go to some of these other planets in my spare time, you know? Because I bet to get a lot of cool stuff in this game we haven't seen yet. Get ready. Get ready. We're gonna have to go guns blazing here, so let's get it. All right, here we go. 